Hello everyone, Linda Israel here, and I am sharing with you the Planetary Wonderlust Creative Kits. I've got the Subscription Box Kit, the Large Journal Kit, the Planner Kit, the Mini Journal Kit, and the Tattered Angels Glimmer Mist, as well as I think I'll show you some new stencils that I have. The Planetary Wonderless subscription box comes with a printed journal kit that has a two-sided journal cover. So this is the cover that you would fold in half to make a five and a half by eight and a half inch tall. It'll be professionally printed by a laser on uh, 100 pound cardstock for the covers and I believe it's 32 pound text weight paper for the pages. So that's the cover. And here is one of the pages, and I'll flip each one over. I decided that I wanted to kind of, you know, be among the stars and the planets because I thought it'd be kind of a fun kit to play with. And I believe Norella of Calico Collage has done a beautiful job with my vision. I picked out some images and then asked her to put it together. One thing I forgot to mention was I hand drew the star so that star and this star are images that I hand drew and then I give them to Norella and she uses them in the kit I love this collaged page and then you get four fussy cut element pages with the subscription box kit so you get corner pieces and words and fussy cut elements here it's got some faux Polaroid and some sayings the word journal. Here's some more vintage looking journal cards. We have some page tabs. There's even a little mason jar full of planets in another elongated uh, Polaroid image. You get two stencils. Again, I drew the design. So the first stencil that we have here, you have a half sheet basically. So it's eight and a half inches tall by 11 inches wide and you get two different patterns. The second stencil is that same pattern that I showed you just a moment ago, an all over design. Now your stencil may have some hanging chad, so you just have to poke those out. My husband and I are just the only ones that work on these, so he doesn't always spend the time to poke out each little thing. You get a bottle of Tattered Angels Glimmer Mist. This is a beautiful shade of a blue, kind of a teal blue. I called it Planetary Wonderlust. I thought it would be a great color in the kit. You get a baggie full of little goodies in the kit. So let me open this up just a little bit. So you get two yards of, I think it's, I want to say it's half inch lace so it's not super big but it's nice yard uh, two yards of lace you get a yard of some yarn that is purple this one's kind of a multicolored, a teal color this one i kind of thought it reminded me of saturn a little bit and a little bit of a pink you also get some blue sequin trim you also get a yard of this fabric and depending on the way the light goes it has a pattern on it and what i like about this is when you dye this with either coffee or even using tattered angels glimmer mist it'll show that a lot better once there's color on it you get some tickets so you get a set of four tickets in a white and four tickets in purple and then you get these oversized tickets. They were from Canvas Court Brands. You get four of those. You also get some tiny, tiny star confetti, little bitty, bitty confetti. And my thought was, is you could put it in this tiny, tiny little jar. I don't know if you can, the, the uh, lights may kind of flash on that, but it's just a little bitty jar. I think it's like, not even an, a, an inch tall, right at an inch tall, but I thought those would look really cute together. You could also fill it with your own things, beads or whatnot. You get some charms. So I've got a bunch of charms here. They'll be random and some of the kits will have maybe a star, 
star, it could be a moon, it could be all kinds of little things. Then you'll get some other random little charms, like these are a key, it looks like a clock watch piece. Here's another little moon that has a rhinestone in it, and you get three of these little uh, bronze stars. Here's another little random charge. Y'all get some, also get some uh, pe uh, photo turns. So with a brad, so you can use those to shut something up or to make a hidden spot. I tried to put these all in little zipper bags so they were easier to manage. You also get a little baggie full of buttons and beads and garment pins as well as some flat back gems that you can use in your journal next you get some paper little paper sacks that you can decorate you get some you get a couple of paper doilies i'm trying to move this over to the side out of the way you get four artist trading card size pieces of craft cardstock you get four square cardstock you get four tags that you can decorate you get some ivory and craft and white cardstock uh, four by four squares you get two sets of these mini file folders so they have the left middle and right tabs that you can fold up it's got a score mark already on them you get a larger piece of ivory cardstock and this one's like watercolor paper it's got a really cool texture on it you get a couple of envelopes this is a standard envelope here is a square envelope i've happened to find in my stash some fabric so this is kind of a not a denim but more like a canvas so a couple shades of blue of canvas you get some book pages in your kit. So you'll get five. These are out of a Bible book pages. This one was all about Carl Sagan's The Cosmos. You get two of those. You get two pages of sheet music. And then you get five pages out of a dictionary. So these would be great for foundation pieces. And then you get two the mixed color they may have images they may not that's all about the stars and the cosmos you also get this perforated paper which may not be able to see it on the video but they're perforated so it comes into eight little sections you get some uh, blue copy weight paper you get two sheets of transparency film so you can make you know windows and shaker cards and then you get two heavy duty pages of cardstock this is like 110 pound cardstock that you can use and then you also get a set of laser chipboard pieces i believe there's 27 pieces you may or may not get the little stars it depends on my husband when he's cleaning out the laser those fall out and so he can't always grab them but the rest of this will be in the kit if I am lucky my laser has been having issues and we got a part order. You will also get a small rubber stamp that'll actually match the stencil. So it'll be this design right here. So if it all goes well, you may also get a rubber stamp. All right, let me clean this all off and then I'll get the other kits. this is the large journal kit and you get it as a digital or as a printed kit and i forgot to mention on the subscription box that is a physical kit with all the goodies if you want the digital there is a digital version that you can get the printed portion of the kit as well as the rest of these that i'm getting ready to show you so for the large journal kit you get two journal covers eight journal pages that are two-sided as well as the covers and six element sheets you also get this cover piece in the printed kit and as a digital so if you want to cut these out print them and cut them out yourself you can do that 
So here is the covers. And again, these will be professionally printed on a laser. I have an inkjet printer and sometimes my ink smears. So disregard that. Yours will be crisp and clean. So here is one of the covers. And that is the inside of the cover. Again, that's one of the star patterns that I made. Here is the second cover. And again, you would fold these in half and they would be eight and a half inches tall, five and a half inches wide. And here is the inside of the cover. And then here is one of the journal pages. And the next one. I really tried to find things that I felt went really well together by the chipboard pieces and the book pages and making the fibers as well as the Tattered Angels Glimmer Mist so that that all can go together. I love this collaged page. And then you get six of the ephemera sheets. So these are fussy cut elements. So you get journal cards. This one has some tags and large belly bands that you can use, you know, across your page or up and down. You get a couple of pockets, and these, again, are the patterns that I drew. Another page of the tags. And then this is the last one, because this was to the other kit. It was extra. Okay, so that was the large journal kit, and you can order that standalone all by itself, or you can order it with the creative kit. Next up, we have the planner kit, and it comes with one two-sided journal cover, six planner pages, and two element sheets, as well as the cover page. So here is the planner cover. And there is the inside of the cover. And then here is one of the two-sided journal pages. Has different patterns on... Actually, it's supposed to have different patterns on both sides, but I think I printed it wrong. But you get the full month. And then on the back side, you get a journaling space. And here's the next one. On the next one. And then this one has a different design. So if you look at those together, you've got two different patterns that you can choose from. And the next page. And the next page. And then this was another journal page. And then here are the fussy cut elements. Again, my printer went offline. It was crazy. It's driving me crazy. Let me tell you. Um, get these little fussy cut elements and then you get these journal cards and that is the planner kit and then here is the mini kit so this is a smaller journal that when you fold it i believe it's five inches by three and a half inches in size and when you get the printed kit you get one set of journal covers and pages. There'll be two journal covers and four journal pages and two fussy cut elements. When you get the digital download, you get to print both of these at the same time. So you, this is how it prints as a digital. And there's the back side. It matches the large journal kit. So you're basically mirroring what the large journal kit looks like. It's just in a miniature form. Here's the fussy cut elements. And that's available as a digital as is all the other printable portions of the kits. I'll show you some of the stencils that I have in my shop. This stencil has been around for a while, but it's called Stars All Over. And it is a larger stencil, so you'll see a bigger pattern. And then this is Moon and Stars stencil. I don't know why, I just thought that's what it kind of reminded me of was little moons with the stars in the middle. So that's something you can purchase separately. This one's called Falling Stars. Now mine is on clear transparency, but yours will be blue like the other stencils. But it has a spattering of stencils at the top and the bottom that kind of come together in the middle. 
This one's called Star Stencil, and so it has different sizes of stars all over. And mine is very dirty because it's very well used. This one's called Scattered Stars, so it has lots of pretty little stars in that. This one's called Quilted Stars, and I don't know, I like this one. I called it quilted because it reminded me of a patchwork quilt. And there is the patterns of that one. This one's a new stencil that I just recently drew. It's called Outer Orbit. Thank you to Jennifer Edmondson for helping me with the names. We were messaging each other and I said, hey, would you help me out and give me, give me some ideas what you thought of names? So we thought that would be a cute name, Outer Orbit. So you've got the center and then those outer pieces. And it may look completely different depending on what color that you choose. And this one's called Starburst Stencils. It's very simple, similar to the Scattered Stars, but it's a little bit different in that it's not as thin in each one of the uh, designs, but there is that pattern as well. I forgot to show the Tattered Angels. There is also an add-on that you can get of six Tattered Angels Glimmer Mist. You get this pink, and this is kind of a gray silver. This is a gold color. We have a kind of a blue-green, a yellow, and purple. So I'll kind of give you what they look like sprayed on paper. So this is the gold. This would be the pink. This is the silver down here. This is the tealy color. This would be the yellow. I guess I'm off screen. And then this would be the purple up here. And then this is the kit color. So you can see this was, I, I was spraying them to decide which one I like the best. And I thought these were the best ones. So you can also add this on, especially if you're new to journaling and you need some Tattered Angels. You can get this set to help supplement your craft stash. All right, everybody. So those are the items that are available. They'll start being available May the 1st in my shop. Then they will all ship out May, I believe it's May 25th. So that gives plenty of time to put in their order so that then I can turn around and order the Tattered Angels and the printed portions of the kits. This is going to be a limited run. I'm not going to have a bunch of these. I think it's around under 40 that I'm going to put together. So if you're wanting one of these kits, definitely order early so that you can get one. And what else? Um, be on the outlook for some of my tutorials. I'll be showing you how to use the Tattered Angels with the stencils. I'll show you how to put some elements together for the subscription box, as well as my live streams, which the first one starts on May the 1st is when I'll do a live stream with the subscription box showing you how to put it together. Thank you everybody for watching. I greatly appreciate each and every one of you. Give this video a thumbs up. If you have any questions, use that comment box down below to find links to the products that I shared. Check the description box or just check out lindaisrael.com as it says across the bottom of the screen here on my webpage. I greatly appreciate you hanging out with me. If you'll share this video with others that you think might be interested in this kit, I would greatly appreciate it. Come see me live on Mondays at 3.45 p.m. Central Standard Time, and I hope to inspire you to create journals. Thanks so much for being here, everybody. Y'all have an amazing day. Bye, everybody.